Sunset Logistics closed its door, shut down its company, left almost 100 drivers stranded on the road. They're probably not going to get the last paycheck, keeping their escrows. I worked there for like almost a year, man. Bunch of scumbags. Couple nice people worked there. Couple nice people. Um, they, they claim to be a Christian company, a God loving company. There's nothing God loving about those people, man. Horrible people. I dodged a bullet with that one, man. T Bone sent me the, the link to the video this morning and I saw that and it was like, wow. And when I was applying to other jobs, the, the safety guy's probably the biggest scumbag of that company, man. His name's Craig Van Dyke. I mean, just treats his drivers like garbage, narcissistic. It is, he's disgusting. Just a disgusting human being. And uh, doesn't surprise me at all, man. Doesn't surprise me at all. I, I worked almost a year. Owner never spoke a word to me. I'd see him, you know, two, three times a week. Made him a lot of money. I couldn't even call him. I'd call and ask him a question. He'd have his one of his secretaries answer, like, talk for him. He was too good to even talk to me. Um, there was a couple of nice people there. There was a lady, I can't remember her name. I want to say Sandra. I don't know. There, 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 were, there was a couple of nice people that worked with the payroll lady. It was super nice. I can't remember her name. But uh, just this is a dirty industry, man. And that's what they get. That's what they get. I don't even know what to say, man. It's, 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 it doesn't surprise me. And I, and I know it's not very godly. I'm not supposed to be happy when I, when my enemies suffer. But these horrible people, man. The safety guy would lie about me. I did I didn't make some mistakes there, but he would tell people like I destroyed all this equipment I didn't destroy, and just he's just a nasty person, man. I, I, uh. they, they screwed over a lot of drivers, man. They, they shut their fuel cards off. They knew this was gonna happen. He knew that that the owner Buddy Gain he knew at least a month in advance that this was going to happen. Didn't give the drivers warning or nothing, just left them in the middle of nowhere, wherever they were, shut their fuel cards off. Probably not going to pay them their escrow back. Just just money, man. Just money. Just money and greed. It just And, and, then, and then they claim to be, you know, godly people. That, that's the nasty part. I mean, I got out in the nick of time, and I'm with, with, I'm with an actual Christian company now, with, with God-fearing people, good people. And what a difference, man. What a difference. What, and I would never have found this place if I didn't work at Sunsos. So, so, it's funny how God works, man. He put me in a perfect place. But, hey, I'm back doing YouTube. I, I know I haven't made a video in a couple months. I do have a video made almost. I got to touch it up. But uh, I'm back recording now. I'm going to start recording again. Um, got some more equipment. Got another GoPro. And uh, look forward to coming back. That's what you get, Sunset. That's what you get, you greedy people.